Hi everyone, this is Andy with Blong.com. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to create a ChatGPT bot in Zoho Click. We're also gonna add the bot to a channel so channel users can ask questions to ChatGPT and get responses directly in the channel. I have a link in the description, a blog post where you can find the code that we're gonna to use today. All right, let's get started. We're going to use the ChatGPT3 API. That is not the latest ChatGPT version but the ChatGPT4 API is not available at the time of filming this video. Once the newer API is available, I'm going to edit a blog post, so make sure to review it before following the instructions in this video. Let's start with the tutorial. Click on your profile picture and then on Bots and Tools. Here we are on the Bots tab. Click on Create Bot. Give the bot a name. In my case, I'm going to name it ChatGPT. Also add a description. For access level, select organization. You can select personal if you are the only one that is going to be using the bot. Under channel participation, select all the options available. This is going to be important for the second part of the tutorial when we add the bot to a channel. If you don't select all the options here, the bot won't work at a channel level. You can upload a bot image here if you prefer. Okay, let's click on save bot. Now click on edit code below message handler. We're going to find the code in the blog post. So let's go to that tab. And on this page, we have two different codes. Make sure you copy the message handler code. So let's select it and copy. Back to Zoho Click. Replace this code with the one we just copied. Okay, now we need to replace this section with the actual ChatGPT API key. So I'm going to switch to my OpenAI account. And this is the API keys tab that you can find in the settings. Let's click on create new security key. And we're gonna copy it with this button. Back to Soho click. Replace this section with the API key we just copied. And now let's save it. That's it for the bot. We can test it out right here. Let's ask, what is Soho CRM? And press enter. The first time you use the bot, it will prompt you to allow it to access information. Click on proceed to allow. And we can see that the bot answered a question. Let's close these settings. The bot window is already open, so let's ask another question. What is Soho Desk? And ChatGPT answered back. All right, now we're gonna add this bot to a channel, so anyone that is on a channel can ask questions. So let's open the channel where we want to add the bot. In my case, I'm gonna use this sales channel. Now click on this icon and now add participants. Here you have to select the ChatGPT bot that we created earlier. Now click on add bot to the channel. Okay, let's click on our profile picture, bots and tools. Now hover over the ChatGPT bot and click on edit handlers. In this new window, click on edit code under participation handler. Let's go back to the blog post and scroll down until you find the participation handler code. Select it and copy it. Back to Zoho Click. And let's replace the code with the one we just copied. And click on Save. Now we need to replace this section with the actual API key. We already generated API key before, which is on the message handler code. So click on participation handler and select message handler. Copy the API key and back to the participation handler. Replace this section with the API key and click on save. That's it. The bot should be able to answer questions on our channel. So let's close the settings. And the sales channel is already open here. So let's ask, what is Zoho Click? Press enter, and the ChatGPT bot responded directly in the channel. We also created another video where we show how to create a ChatGPT slash command, so check out the description for more information. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you did, please click the like button. We have other Zoho videos on this channel, so feel free to check them out. If you're a Zoho admin and would like to learn more about how to integrate different Zoho apps, we made a Zoho One class that covers how to configure and integrate the top 10 most useful Zoho One apps. Check the links in the description for more information. Thanks for watching.